So what happened to Sputnik? After it was launched, Sputnik continued to broadcast its incessant beeping for 21 days until the onboard transmitter batteries ran out on the 26th of October 1957. Although it stopped broadcasting, Sputnik could still be tracked, and despite its lack of sensors, this tiny satellite still returned some valuable data of the Earth's upper atmosphere. Sputnik's orbit almost immediately began to decay, which was planned by the way, and on the 4th of January 1958, Sputnik burned up as it re-entered the Earth's atmosphere. This tiny, highly polished sphere had survived three months in space, and completed 1,440 orbits of the Earth, and travelled over 70 million kilometres while doing so. The only surviving piece of Sputnik is this metal arming key. It was used to prevent contact between the batteries and the transmitter before it was launched, much like the plastic tags you find in new electronics. This key is currently on display in the Smithsonian National Air and Space Museum in Washington DC, and there is no doubt there will be a replica of Sputnik in a science museum near you.